what we have here is a motor that can run continuously forever because you run it on one stack of batteries and you charge up another. So this is a combination motor generator that turns on and off. And here's the switch right here. It's a magnetic reed switch. It's a switch that's controlled by a magnet going by it. This flame that happens inside this reed switch has a lot of power to it. So that's, a, that's what I'm looking to have is like a commercial unit people could buy in a store, something like this. Uh, just something that runs on car batteries, charges car batteries, and you have excess power with a generator to, to do whatever you want with. So it's free energy. Because <laughs> you don't have to pay for it. It's, it's just happening. It's free. Hello everyone. Today we'll explore the enigmatic invention of Doug Konzen, the pulse motor. Doug claimed his motor generated more power than used, using only magnets. We'll cover Doug's device, the controversy around it, and why it never came to market. Get ready for an intriguing journey. Doug Konzen was fascinated by engineering from a young age. In the 1980s, he began experimenting with ways to create rotational motion just from magnets. His early prototypes showed promise, but one design produced unexpected results. It seemed to be generating more energy than input. Doe called his invention the pulse motor. Its key part was a magnetized flywheel within an outer magnetic coil array. Doug reported it produced up to 50 horsepower continuously enough for industrial uses. He published plans, puzzling scientists how magnets supposedly broke thermodynamics. Doug believed that by finely tuning the magnetic flux densities in his design, environmental electromagnetic fields were being extracted and converted to electricity in violation of what's predicted. However, without independent analysis, most rejected his claims as pseudoscience due to the apparent impossibility. Word of Doug's supposedly limitless power motor spread rapidly online. Some saw it as humanity's greatest invention, if real, capable of revolutionizing civilization with free energy. But mainstream science remained exceptionally skeptical without concrete proof. Most viewed it as pseudoscience until verified. Doug established the Konzen Engineering Development Lab to fully analyze and improve his motor. But progress was slow, with targets slipping as new hurdles emerged. Criticism grew that without open testing, Doug's motor was merely an idea, plausible on paper alone, but not proven in practice. Seeking validation, Doug partnered with university laboratories and companies but most refused examining his claims without independent proof, lacking faith in extraordinary assertions. Doug struggled to fund R and D himself in isolation. Critics said this showed his motor was more hypothetical than demonstrated. Frustrated by rejection, Doug grew defensive toward institutional science. He accused them of bias against new ideas not wanting disruptive free energy acknowledged. But most argued independent review wasn't suppression. It ensured extraordinary assertions were rigorously tested before accepting revolutionary implications. Through the 1990s and 2000s, Doug's health declined as his lab failed meeting prototype goals. He continued patenting ideas, but showed little tangible progress. Online, some alleged nefarious sabotage by interests wishing to protect the status quo. But skeptics saw only empty promises without open, credible testing and proof of operation. Without access to reliable prototypes and performance data, most conclude his invention remains an unproven hypothesis that contradicts known physics. But online devoted forums still debate its suppressed potential. While Doug's specific claims went unverified, his pursuits helped advance material science, shedding light on areas warranting deeper research. Electromagnetism's frontiers continue inspiring fresh study as enabling tech matchers. Progress happens gradually through questioning assumptions with care, rigor, 
and open cooperation over generations. Today, some researchers hope jointly examining anomalies of unproven devices through transparency and systematic study may offer hitherto unseen insights. Subtle reproducible effects, if any, could guide fruitful new lines of scientific inquiry, even if originating hypotheses prove flawed or misguided. Whether Dobb truly had a limitless motor or not, his spirit of boundless curiosity lives on. From amateur experimenters to serious academics, visionaries worldwide diligently probe nature's farthest edges with imagination, integrity and collective betterment as goals. If discoveries one day harness energies directly as pioneers proposed, it may emerge through patience and bridges across specialties. Respectful collaborative study of unusual phenomena furthers everyone's understanding at a pace respecting complexity itself. Our journey into Doug Comson's pulse motor concludes, yet inquiries never end. Independent thinkers and serious analysts worldwide advance frontiers creatively and rigorously as one. May hypotheses find fair examination through open yet scrupulous cooperation. Whether revolutionary claims hold truth or not, free exchange of respectful ideas benefits all. Diverse philosophies combine judiciously quicken collective comprehension of nature's profoundest workings. Basic science thrives under this pluralistic ethos uniting goals. Future breakthroughs may originate from any field. Until then, steady multidisciplinary effort together maintains hopes. Answering enigmas left by pioneers supports connecting curiosity to better lives worldwide. United, insight and goodwill overcome all limits given thoughtful time. In conclusion, sharing diverse yet dignified perspectives lifts everyone. All avenues deserve careful reinspection, avoiding complacency. With imagination, integrity and fairness across differences, humanity may grasp reality's depths far beyond today's consensus. Together all progress continues. Our expedition into Doug Comson's motor finishes here, yet questing is perpetual. From future revolutionaries to considerate observers, advancing knowledge remains life's noblest purpose. May open-mindedness and goodwill quicken revelations for all. Discovery marches on. Thank you for sharing this journey. May your own explorations uncover nature's mysteries, whether affirming present views or forging new through diligence, care and vision. Farewell until next, we meet to marvel at wonders still unknown. Onward to tomorrow.